I'm Coach Todd, head coach in the Limits Triathlon.com, and today I'm going to give you some tips on if you're training for your first half Ironman. This video is specifically for the Chinook uh, Triathlon coming up in June. Uh, this is a return to Calgary, which is pretty exciting. Mike Bach is the race director. He swims each week with me. He asked me, "Hey Todd, would you?" Uh, write an article for me. I said, sure, you know what, I'm gonna make a video instead because it's easier. Right now I'm just finishing my long run. Okay, so if this is your first half Ironman, there's some things you need to do. First thing, obviously, you need to train. So you need to come up with a training schedule. I recommend at least two swims, two bikes, and two runs. If you live in an ideal world, go through three and three. And how you break those up is the first one can be an easy or technique workout. The second one could be a variety of things. So if you're running, it could be speed work, tempo work, uh, hill work, things like that. If you're on a bike, again, you can do hill work, speed work, strength work. And then the third workout you want to do is a longer, longer workout. So if you're swimming, swim up towards 2K. If you are biking, Right now we're outside, it's winter time, but try to build yourself up to three hours on the bike. You can go four if you want, but right now like we're in February. The longest bike ride I do with a group is two and a half hours, and that's plenty. But once it gets nicer outside, you can build that up to, to three or four hours. When you're running, the long run, I would suggest starting off at an hour, but if you're just starting, start off at 30 minutes and gradually build. And you can build up to, you could get away with as little as an hour 45, or you can go up to two hours, or 2.15, or a little bit more if you want to. Uh, the whole idea of racing a half Ironman is that it's, pacing is very, very key. So the effort's not very high, but you need to be able to go a long distance at a certain pace. So those are some things you can think about as you're training for this race. I'll make another video or an article soon, but you can follow me at nolimitstriathlon.com. I'll be at the race. Hey, one fond memory I have of the Chinook race, it's been on for many years. I've watched it many times, I've never done it. I've had lots of my athletes do it. Is I'd be that guy, maybe if you've done this race, you've seen me, down in Fish Creek, I would have just finished a bike class, so I go down to the valley. But I'm hungry, right? I'm really hungry. If I stop off, stop off at McDonald's, I get some uh, quarter pounder meal. That's what I like, quarter pounder meal. And I'm eating French fries as the runners go by. And they're always saying, hey, can I have one? I'm like, sure. No one's ever taken me up on the offer, though. But anyways, that's a fond memory that I have. And I hope this year I'll do the same thing. Maybe we'll have Subway this year. Anyhow, this is Coach Todd saying thank you very much and happy training.